a guy in his early 20s, Adam Botkin has lived a life well-traveled, and it's only just beginning. The Frenchtown native joined the Montana Grizzlies as a senior walk-on at kicker this past summer to get his first crack at college football. A moment turned into reality in the Grizzlies opener against Northwestern State and a special moment for a player who grew up just down the road. It's been super crazy. Not playing football for four years was definitely interesting and then getting the opportunity to come back was super cool. Uh, social media uh, was like a big part in that, so that's a huge part of what I do. They run out the tunnel for the first time definitely was cool. My mom sits on that side, on the north end zone side, front row, so I got to like get a point at her every time I run out the tunnel. And then just getting to play with these guys is a great group of guys. And it's been an unorthodox journey to get to this point. Coming out of Frenchtown High School, in 2018, Bakken had an opportunity to play college basketball at Rocky Mountain College, but opted to instead just attend UM as a student. There, he picked up an opportunity to work as a practice player for the Montana Lady Grizz. It was super fun. Honestly, it kept me in shape, so that was a huge part of it. But at the same time, I just wanted to experience some sort of college sport aspect since I was kind of feeling a little empty after the high school sports ended. Bakken did that for three years while trying to find ways to walk on with Grizz basketball or football. But after his junior year of college, he moved to Arizona for an opportunity opportunity to work with some YouTubers as a content creator, videographer, editor, and more, and he did that for a year. But this guy was different. His name was Adam Botkin, and here's what he said. It was there Botkin began to build his own social media following, especially on TikTok, where he has amassed over 80,000 followers and over 4.6 million likes, and he's also garnered 11.5 million views on Instagram just last month. Honestly, it was crazy. I got to meet a lot of cool people like ended up in Kurt Warner's backyard at one point. There's a lot of crazy experiences that I wouldn't have got if the social media stuff didn't happen, if the prior walk-on stuff had happened. I believe everything happens for a reason, so I feel like it all led me to where I am right now. From skits to workouts to inspirational messages and advice to younger players, Bakken is always looking for new ways to come up with content on his platforms. We just kind of had this little group where we'd go to the field and make content. And that's the beauty of making content in, this, in like the niche that I'm in is I'm already on the field. So I'm putting in work and creating content. There's no difference between my time there. So I'm able to be serious, put in the work and you know, sometimes do the lighthearted TikToks to where have a little fun with it. But in April of 2021, just prior to moving to Arizona, Bakken injured his meniscus, a serious knee injury in his kicking leg that sidelined him from working out. 10 weeks later, Bakken injured it again in Arizona as the setback was prolonged. But after recovering, Bakken found a way back into working out, and after making a connection with former Grizz kicker Kevin Macias, he was able to get in touch with the Grizz coaching staff, join the team, and after his long journey, made his dream of college athletics a reality. And he hopes his story serves as inspiration on the platform he's created. There's nothing better than getting a message from a kid that just played on Friday night. You get a message on Saturday morning, say, I, I just played my best game ever. I like look up to you and have seen your content. It pushed me to work a little bit harder that next day. So honestly, that combined with from the small town, not much recruitment opportunity. So I want to be able to help give back to those kids that don't necessarily have that recruitment opportunity, help them figure it out so they can get to the next level or just pursue what they want in life. Reporting in Missoula, Kyle Hansen, MTN Sports.